as journalists, we're expected to cover all different types of stories, which means on a day to day, our reporters and photographers get to experience the good, bad and the ugly. But whatever the story of the day may be, there's always a reminder of how special the Rio Grande Valley is. Here's photojournalist Dan Galvan in this week's Photographer's Perspective. Every day as a news photographer, I'm reminded why I love the Rio Grande Valley. As journalists, we go out and tell stories, and constantly, those stories are a reminder of why the RGV is special. Yeah, this is my neighbor's fence from across the street over here. Even in tragedy, like with the tornado that caused destruction in Laguna Heights, you can find reminders of hope and selflessness, from big gestures to small ones. Cassandra Garcia and I visited a laundromat that offered free services to the tornado victims. We talked to Margarita Alonzo, who helps manage the business. And Margarita, she spent her whole life in the area. Her message about her community's resilience, it's what stuck with me. Knowing this community, we always have each other's back. I know Laguna Heights will be back. Not only is it the people that make the RGV great, but it can be the places like Gladys Porter Zoo. Last month, I visited the zoo with Christian Von Price, and walking into the zoo, it brought back memories of the magic it was like the first time I visited as a kid. Seeing the monkeys, zebras, and even the goats took me down memory lane. Is where the nurses would be. Uh, I have very lovely nurses. Lastly, a story of courage and inspiration. Deontay Marini and I told the story of Diego Huerta. For three years, Diego's been battling leukemia. Our story was about how Diego was ending his chemotherapy pill treatment and was going to be able to ring that bell. The young man had a message about hope and faith. That message is what my community, our community, the RGV, is all about. Don't lose hope. I, I'd say you, you really need to have that faith in you because... I struggled a lot with uh, believing I'd get back to normal, but now that I'm, I'm at the, the finish line, I, I can already feel it, and it, it just it gets better. With my photographer's perspective, I'm Daniel Galvan.